<risa> no cocaína, que hay eso es. Focada. Focada. Oh, that's sweet and nice. Mmm. Super rico. Arroz de coco dulce, ensalada, pescado y patacones. Okay. Super rico. Hola. ¿Cómo estás? Bien. Bien, bien, bien. ¿Qué estamos cooking today? Arroz de coco frito. Con pescado. Pescado. Ensalada. Ok. Nice. Let's see what's going on. So she's going to blend the coconut. We should chop up already. She had to smash it, pick up the juice. The fresh coconut there that she's going to blend off. And then this here, she's going to go into the rice. This is called panela. In English, it's sugar cane. So she's going to add the water to the coconut now and it's gonna blend it just for a few minutes Fresh coconut milk. We're not using no tinned coconut milk from the shop. We've got a real coconut and we blended it ourselves. And you can see here, this is how you make natural fresh coconut milk. I add some more water to it and blend it again. Lovely. Second batch. Slice that up fine and then I'm gonna add this white vinegar. It's a pickle vinegar. This is what we use in Colombia. You pour that over it and you leave it for like half an hour in the fridge and it soaks in it and you strain it off and then that's the veg. I mean then that's the salad done. And here now this is the this is the coconut milk and the panela. But she said that we have to make it boil down into a caramel, but I didn't know that so which is very interesting. We're gonna see how it goes. So we have to boil down to a caramel, and then we're gonna add the rice to it, mix it, and then we're gonna add more coconut milk. So it's literally gonna be. I'm very excited for this. See how it goes. That's the coconut milk and the panela in there now. So that's the sugar 
and coconut milk basically. And you're just prepping up, prepping up the salad. The salada. And the salada. Nice blend. Salad chopped up nice and fine. I'm gonna add this in a bit. Now she's peeling the green plantain. If you don't know, this is very hard to do, but in Colombia, this is like nothing. So, and so she's gonna be a pro. We will see. Okay, she got that off. See the technique with the knife. That's really good. Am I wrapping it up? Yeah. Okay. Let's see. Let's okay, I'm just gonna fry them off. See. Into the, this is the water which you got some garlic in and we're going to season it with some, with some thyme and some pepper and I'm just going to fry them, flatten them, put them in there and fry them again. I'm just waiting for this to turn into the caramel. It's going to take a while. The smell the caramel smells sweet and nice so I can't wait to try this. It's a traditional a Colombian dish. Okay. And salt, salt. Salt. Pequito. Is it done? Come on. Don't mean it's done. Okay, just have about two minutes more. And we're ready to add rice. I can see. Okay, it's like a caramel now. It's here in the box. Smells delicious. Ah, you can see it's more thick. The top of caramel on there. That's it. Right. Top of caramel on there. So, you've got to take it off before it starts to burn. Okay. It's ready? It's ready now. Okay. I kept it, I kept it on color now. See? Right, right. Actually, that's the perfect colour now. And scrape off the sides. So now it's gonna melt. Okay. Cocada. <laughs> no cocaína. Okay, yes, what is it? Cocada. Cocada. 
Okay. Oh, that's sweet and nice. Mmm. Super Rico. Okay. Bueno. Claro. That's all. Okay. We gotta bring it back now. Because it's so sweet. We gotta bring it back with some salt. I think I'll dull it down a bit before we add the rice. So, when that caramel melts out into the coconut milk, then we're gonna add the rice. So, you can see the process. Very interesting. <laughs> so, I just added some mustard. And I should add the garlic. I'm not too sure what this is for. I'm gonna find out in real time. Chopping up the mustard fine. So we should grind it out, make it into a paste. I learned these things in college, I don't know how to learn. So we've got the garlic and the mustard. And we're add the lime. Picante or no? Planting for as well. I'm going to show you the process of that now. Okay. I'm just going to boil up and steam. So that's why the rice gets brown. Because I've always thought, why is the rice brown? I didn't know how you did it, but now I'm not. So I'm, saying, I'm learning right now. I just see it on YouTube. I'm learning as well. And so you can always be a chef, but there's always stuff that you can learn, you know. So, yeah. But I'm definitely going to try this one again. Definitely. Got the crunch and fry them up now. I'm going to try them up, flatten them, dip them, fry them again. And then once the rice is a little bit, you can make it a fish stand. Okay, so we've got the rice cooked. Let's see what the rice looks like. Flatten them. Pat that on. And then she's going to dip them in into the garlic water. And she's going to fry them again. As you can see here, with the rice. I love the colour of it. She looks nice and nice golden colour. You can see. So I'm 
boiling off. Once the water comes off it, we'll turn it to the sauce. Put it in the garlic water and stir it in the oil. Starting to cook now. Nice golden brown colour. Looks lovely. Some golden brown, you love to see it. Strain of excess oil, and voila. I, 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 I fell in love with these a long time ago, and now these are my favorite type of planting. It's always green planting, I've got white planting now. I grew up on white planting my whole life, but I realized that green planting is, is the way forward, definitely. Okay, nice. <laughs> Gosh. So the fish. That's, that's a whole one, it's not, no? Okay. Can we fix it? I'll fix it, I'm going to half it as well. I'm not going to fix it. You see, so just cut through the thing and just go right through the middle. There you go. Coming along now. Cooking down nicely. What we love to see. Fish is firm. So we're nearly there. Nearly there, nearly there, nearly there. Can't wait to eat now. Hungry. Hungry, hungry. Hungry. I'm going to try not to hungry now. Hungry. 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 Hungry, hungry, hungry. Second fish in. Not much. So once the fish is cooked, then we're ready to go. We're in on the rice. Tomato, 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 tomato. Yeah. 
Ten. <laughs> so five and it looks like it's a ten. Arroz de coco dulce, ensalada, pescado y patacones. Correct. Okay. Super rico. <laughs> so now you can see the food. And you're already tucking in. How it tastes? See? Okay, now sister's come to join now. The food is bueno. Oh, no. You see here, we've got the coconut rice, and we've got the fried fish, platter corners, and the salad. So I'm going to squeeze my lemon on, and we're going to talk in, and um, I'll let you know how it is. And I'm steaming hot, it's 33 degrees outside, that's why, but it is the coconut. Sweet rice. Okay. It's really nice. It's sweet. But it's nice. Okay. Salad. Fish. Eat that with my hands. I'm trying to eat better on camera if you don't realize. So I'm trying to eat with my mouth closed. This is delicious. Yeah, and plus the corners. Mm -hmm. My favourite. So, thanks for watching the video. Remember to like, comment, subscribe. We'll be back soon with more videos. And yeah. Okay. So, wherever you, you're watching from, Enjoy the rest of your day and don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I'm saying ciao, adios. <laughs>